In my previous video about how to create a Christmas coloring book, we discussed how much coloring books are popular and profitable. So that's why I decided to show you how you can create a mandala coloring book, which is the most popular type of coloring books. Today, I will show you how to use symmetry feature on Photoshop to quickly and easily create your own unique mandala design. If you are new to this channel, my name is Anna and I do videos on how to create, maintain and grow your KDP business. If you like videos like that, then make sure you hit the subscribe button and also smash that notification bell to receive notifications when I produce videos like this. And if you do like it, please give it a thumbs up. It's very much appreciated. After this video, you will be able to make designs just like this one in few minutes. In Photoshop, go to top menu, click on File, click on New, and you can enter your dimensions 8.5 by 11 inches and hit Create. On left side, click on Brush Tool or you can use the short key of B. On the top toolbox, click on the small butterfly and choose a mandala. You can choose how many mandala symmetries you want to have, but for this example, we are going to go with 10. Now click on one of the edges and make your guide a little bit bigger. Press B for brush or click on the left side on the brush tool and start drawing your shapes. Because of the symmetry feature, whatever you draw, it will be mirrored and repeated on each pie. Believe it or not, your job almost done here. Just get creative and draw random lines to make patterns. I'm going to fast forward this part since I'm just drawing lines.
Editing patterns in this way is very, very easy. If you hit Ctrl Z or delete a part of the design, it will be removed from all pies. It's again because of the symmetry feature on Photoshop. Creating this design took me less than 20 minutes, but you can create yours even quicker. As you create more and more designs, you will get quicker and will have an idea of what you want to draw for the next pattern. Second method to create a mandala design is even easier. There are several websites that you can download and use for your KDB coloring book. The website that I use personally and I'm convinced is the best one on the market is Creative Fabrica. Just type Mandela on search bar and once you found your design, click on it, click on download, open the file. Select all of the designs, click on color box and change the color to black. Now open up a new file in a letter size and drag your design to the new file, just like this. Make sure the file is on the center of the page. Click on one of the edges and drag it like this to make it bigger. If you're happy with the results, you can use this one for your coloring book. But I usually tend to combine two or three designs together to make a unique one. So now go back to Creative Fabrica and download one or two more designs. Open it under Illustrator, drag and drop the file to your uh, letter size file. Make sure it's on center of the page. Open up the second file and again just drag it to your main file. Make sure it is on center and adjust the size. As you can see, the edges of two outer borders doesn't match with each other. So I'm going to delete this one. And I actually like to change the center of the design to just delete these four pattern. Go back to one of your designs and drag and drop it to the center. Final design would be a unique design that you can use on your KDP coloring book. So now you're going to want to create numerous pages and a little trick you might want to consider doing is if you go to the right hand side and click on uh, designer's name, you will see other artworks that this artist has produced. And you can go and get the images that are very similar in a slide to the ones you've already created uh, for your coloring book page. So that then you can create this whole coloring book that has a similar style and feel and therefore you're producing something a bit more cohesive. So that's it for now. That's a relatively simple way of creating a coloring book interior page. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below and I do my best to answer them all. Well, that's it for now. Thank you very much for watching and don't forget to hit that subscribe button, smash the notification bell and give it a thumbs up if you liked the video. 
and、uh, you have a great day. See you soon. Bye bye.